welcome back to my channel and if you're new welcome today i have a awesome video for you guys i truly believe something a little different from me um i decided to do my own nails and you know what comes with doing your own nails you need the supplies my voice is always gone but um yeah so i needed okay let me do a little background story to this real quick and make it short, sweet, and simple. Well, I cannot get my nails done at the salon because I take off my nails the next day all the time. So I decided to, you know, obviously make a couple of purchases and start doing them myself. A lot of people don't want to do them by themselves because they think they're too preppy to do that. Or they think that, you know, that's what's trending going to the salon. Or they just probably like going to the salon. I mean, who am I to judge, you know? Like me, like I work work a lot I also go to the gym a lot I also do a lot of things I'm a hands-on person I kind of need some nails that will be on and off and I like to get them super long these are not even close to long enough but they're they're good for me for today but um, until I find some long tips I'm going to be rocking stuff like this but let me let me let me let me let me get to it okay that's basically more about why I need to do my own nails because I don't feel that it's necessary even if I have the money to go and buy go to the salon and get them done just to take them off tomorrow and that has happened to me actually every time that has happened to me so you guys do hear my dogs I do apologize the crying like little babies anyways so I needed to get the supplies I have the um, I have some fake nail tips that I ordered off of Amazon um, I got some supplies that I got from Walmart also I decided I needed um, nail polishes and you know girls we like to have every color in the book because it has to match with our outfits no my nails do not match with my outfit right now but it will soon okay if I have a lot of nail polishes I knew I needed to get a organizer or something that could, I could put my nail polishes in instead of having it in a box or looking at it in a bag or anything like that. Um, I don't have enough nail polishes to put them on my wall and I don't think I ever will because I'm not that much, I'm into nails but I don't think it's necessary to have it on my wall. Even if I, I mean maybe if I had a bigger place that would probably work but I feel I could just put it into a container and something I can see. So I did a lot of research going on um, Instagram, going on YouTube videos, and I guess there's this new case that a lot of people are getting, and I decided to try it out for myself. I ordered it off of Amazon. It's actually the same brand I got these nail tips from. Um, it's like, hmm. bro, hold on. My phone. Here we go. It's the Macarot. Macarot? Can't pronounce it. Large nail polish. I will put the name somewhere over here. So you can get different ones. There's some that come with 48 um, spots for your nail polishes. Um, the one I got has 60 spots. So there's 30 in the front, 30 in the back. Yeah, it's yeah the Marklet Large Nail Polish. Um, it's basically like a nail polish case. I also was able to fit a couple of my other things in there, but I did receive it yesterday and I immediately put my nail polishes in there and I wanted to show you guys, so just in case you guys were looking for something to put your nail polishes in. That would have been embarrassing if like the whole thing like broke apart and like that would have been just ridiculous. I don't even want to imagine that. This is basically what it looks like. Let me find the best way to hold this. Um, I try to color coordinate just a little bit, but like I don't even have enough nail polishes to do that. I thought I had a lot, but apparently I don't. There's a front and there's a back. Um, and this is where the empty compartment is where I could put a couple of my things in there. Sheesh. I think I'm a little heavy. It's going to make me work out a little bit, go to the gym. Try to open this the best way possible without dropping everything so you guys could see it. I could always open it up on my bed, but I'm gonna try to do this. You open the front part is there's a spot right here. You open both clips. Come on now. There we go. And the first side, it's like a little door flap. And then you got the nail polishes right there. And I try to, like I said, color coordinate a little bit, but you know, I can only do so much, so. But I got my black, my reds, my purples, and then blue greens or blues down there. By the way, this handle is very, very, very sturdy. Like I can 
it's not like a plastic flimsy lid um, handle, so it helps me out. And then the other side is the same way as the other one, but you pop it. And there it go. I'm trying to get that plastic out of my face. But I don't want to drop them, but. And I got my pinks and my um, nudes. And then I'm trying to get some neon colors added to my collection. But I think this is a good beginner or starter case if you guys just want to start getting your nails done. Um, if you guys have a lot of nail polishes and that you guys kind of want to put away, but you don't want to. Um, but you don't want to put away in a box where you can't see them. I really like this because you can see everything. You don't have to open the thing and then be like, okay, where's the color at now? Like you live like literally, I could display this right here. You guys already see what colors I have in there. And it's really large, it's really nice. Um, I like that you can put it, like slide it under your bed. You can slide it on the side of the wall. Like it's very easy and if you want to go, and hang out with your friends and get y'all's nails done. Just grab it and go. I thought it was very important to show you guys um, quickly how I'm carrying my nail colors and my nail polishes. Um, it's also a cute decoration for your room, so I could probably put it on my dresser, just like slanted, or put it on the side, or just somewhere out where people know that, you know, I'm literally a girl. And I got my stuff together a little bit, so. This is something that a lot of us should get, and especially if you have a, like a thousand nail polishes. You can get a couple of these. I actually seen it um, on this video. This girl, she had a, a nice amount of these, and she just had them slanted, and every single one had one color in it. Like there was like blues, light blues to dark blues, and then the other side was light, um, dark greens to light greens, or like you can get a bunch of these and then store them in here. And then so whenever you have them sitting up. You can just go through the wall like, okay, I need, got it. I just wanted to quickly show you guys that real quick and show you guys that, you know, you don't have to put your stuff in a bag no more. You don't have to, why is my stuff? Oh, this is the, I'm not going to say newest way, but this is a good affordable way. Um, this costs $32 and that's for the 60 compartments. I've seen a lot of them that have the 48 compartments. They start off at $15 or $16. So you can probably get that, whatever fits your budget, you can do that. I feel like this fits everyone's budget. Um, I will definitely be leaving the link down below so you guys can definitely go look it up. Like I said, I got it off of Amazon and I um, actually got it very quickly. I ordered it on Monday and I got it by Friday. No, I ordered it Tuesday. Yeah, I ordered it Tuesday and I got it Friday, so. Um, yeah. So if you guys are interested in um, the nail polish case, I will definitely be leaving the link down below so you guys can get it. I might leave the 48 one, the 48 slots, or I could leave the 60. I could probably leave both. So if you guys have any further questions, as always, contact me off of my social media or comment down below and let me know. Um, I will be happy to answer any questions you guys may have. And I will definitely be seeing you guys soon.